Hi guys, Perfect UK back, and today we're going to be doing a review on the Aroma Miser RDTA from Steam Crave. <coughs> I did pick this up from my local vape shop, the No Bacatists, which are the UK distributor for Steam Crave. So I will link their website in the description where you can pick this up. Um, and they do do the other aromizers as well, the version one and the version two in hexagon and the circle shaped. <coughs> um, so yeah, let's uh, dive down. And we'll uh, have a little look at it. Right, guys. So here we are uh, down close. We'll have a quick run through of the box. I'm sure most of you now have seen reviews on this, so you've probably seen the box, but we'll have a quick run through. Um, you get a spare uh, airflow control ring, uh, loads of spare O-rings, and spare uh, crosshead screws and Allen key screws. Your little blue screwdriver, your Allen key, and a spare glass piece. <laughs> So that is pretty it for the box. So here we're having a look at the tank now guys. You've got your uh, black airflow control ring which does and doesn't work. It's quite weird. Um, it's a bit dirty. Let's just get some of that juice off there. This hasn't got a build in it at the moment. <coughs> um, drip tip, you can use your own drip tip, 510 if you want. Uh, the one you get with it has got the spit back protection and you've got some quite big airflow holes there. Um, you've got four of them air hole ring, air holes Around the side there, we'll take a look at the deck. There's your deck. If you see there, you have them two little tiny holes right on the bottom are where your uh, juice comes in from your tank. Um, and this does come already with the Phillips screws in which I changed out for the Allen key screws which I find they're a lot better um, they don't snap your wires when you're trying to build um, I have found this deck to be a bit of a pain to build on because you do need to keep your um, let me just grab <coughs> You do need to keep your build uh, inside of this area um, because of putting it back in to your base you need to make sure them coils are not touching any of this side wall um, so you haven't got a lot of room uh, to play with there um, but I'm not really sure guys it's not a bad little um, tank um, just for me trying to put you a lot of the builds I've had to put on it to give it that room to be able to get it in there are really really low um, 
I don't like to build down too low um, but I will uh, chuck a build it back in this um, that's pretty much it you can if you want to unscrew it if you need to change your, your glass if you need to um, I'm not going to do that right now it is quite tight um, I've never had to replace it um, there you've got your uh, your fill ports you've got loads of these fill ports which is nice and easy you can just put your dropler or if you've got a little nozzle just put it straight in and just fill it up to about where the uh, where the glass stops at the top there um, but it pretty much is straightforward um, this is going to be a quick review guys I've just for me this is going to be a love or hate tank or RDTA um, for me it just doesn't feel like a dripper it feels more like an RTA <coughs> um, but that is my opinion um, so we'll, we'll go back up top and we'll have a toot and a chat and we'll uh, see how it performs so guys back up top with the Aroma Miser RDTA um, we whipped it up now uh, I went with a 26 gauge camp file uh, at uh, 8 wraps uh, dual coil uh, and that came out at 0.37 and I'm running at 45 watts um, <clears throat> the only thing I'll be careful with guys is when you're wicking it you don't want to put a lot of cotton in there where them juice um, the juice holes at the bottom underneath the cotton you really don't want to pack your cotton in there because it's going to struggle to uh, wick and you'll get some dry hits um, so you really want to keep that cotton nice and light and short and um, it should wick pretty well um, go check out some other reviews guys um, I know uh, I believe it's Robert Ellis he did a build on the Roma Miser um, for me I like it and I don't um, it's nice if you're out and about and you want something that you haven't got a drip um, but for me it, it feels too much like an RTA um, not a dripping tank I don't know um, I don't mind it the airflow ring I don't really understand at all um, this is uh, full open we'll go about half I'll try and get you to see that about half closed the air for me there about exactly the same if I close it just so a tiny bit is open that is a bit more restricted and that way you do get a lot more of the flavour of your juice whatever you've got in there but I find the wide open and half open it's, it's about the same same sort of airflow, it's a, a lot of airflow um, so I usually just have it on that closed little area and get a nice tight draw but you can still lump it, it's not tight tight So yeah, um, it's okay guys, it's, it is just going to be one of those things that you're either going to love it and you're going to use it all the time, or like me, um, it's something that I use if I don't want to be dripping. <coughs> um, I love dripping now, it's all I do most of the time is drip, like at the moment I've got my tugboat 
version 2 on my tugboat box. That's what I use most of the day. <clears throat> um, and sometimes I do have the castigator with the production RDA. I'll run that as well throughout the day. Which the, I don't know how you want to pronounce it, the castigador will be up for review on Friday. Um, Wednesday, I'm just trying to decide if I want to do a juice review or if I'm going to have a quick look at a little XTAR uh, battery charger that I've got given uh, free for review. Um, I may actually not do a juice review this week and I might actually have a look at the uh, quick look at the battery charger. So it's going to be a quick short video for Wednesday. Um, I have got some giveaway updates um, going on. <clears throat> which I might actually do that now let's give something away <laughs> sat in my drawer and I don't use it anymore um, it's gonna be the aero tank um, which has got the airflow control I'm gonna be giving this away guys anybody wants it um, <coughs> I will give it a, it will be I'll give it a clean before it gets sent out guys um, it is a bit dirty but like I said it hasn't been used <coughs> um, You've got your airflow control ring. <coughs> uh, it has got a coil um, already inside. Plus there's uh, two spare coils and your beauty ring as well there. Um, <coughs> this is going to be for the UK only. Um, but I have got a big uh, giveaway coming up when I hit 500 subscribers which will be for uh, the UK and international. But this giveaway is only for the UK. Um, you do need to be uh, subscribed and just comment uh, comment below, uh, I don't know, something like giveaway and you'll get entered into the giveaway. Um, <clears throat> I can't even remember, so it's been a while. Um, I'm not sure what them coils are guys. Let's have a quick look. I think there's something like 1.8 or something. So this could be like a little gift if you wanted to get it for um, someone to um, who wants to try quitting smoking. Um, I can't even see any writing on them. I believe they are 1.8. Let's have a quick look. Whack it on the flask and see what the ohms is coming out at. Let's see what's in there. 2.2 .2. and I do believe that's what the uh, spare coils are as well 2.2 ohms so it is a nice tight tight draw for your beginner or anybody like still using them I'm gonna be giving that away guys um, just comment below um, giveaway or something like that and you'll be entered into the giveaway UK only um, and we'll give that away <coughs> so guys like I say, you're either going to love it or you're going to hate it, the aromamizer. Um, oh, I don't want that doing that, do we? Good coil. So, yeah, you're either going to love it or you're going to hate it. <clears throat> um, go check it out, guys. If you haven't tried one, pick one up. They're pretty cheap. Uh, 30 pound I believe um, 
the no Baptists are um, listing it for but that information will be in the description along with their website um, so yeah go check it out guys Randomise RTA Parish Vep UK out remember guys stay safe and keep on vaping